hey i just wanted to step in and welcome the vlog i hope everyone is doing well i'm trying to start my morning a little intentional here by making myself some avocado toast as you guys know i am so hooked on avocado toast and kill me crazy was not going to keep getting my money so i prepped the things that i needed to make my avocado toast easy breezy in the morning okay so right now i'm just cutting up some scallions and cilantro and i added that to my avocado and here's the finished product some bacon on top of my sourdough bread that i got from the farmer's market and some fresh greased orange juice it's so good y'all so good and nowhere near the price i've been paying it kept me crazy so i have a little bit of a busy day but i wanted to do some recording as well i have some new items that i received so we're going to do a little bit of a try on haul from zara but i had to do a couple emails first and now we're going to pop into this good little zara haul one piece jumpsuit it is like a cream colored jumpsuit it has a bit of a mock neck here you guys see it has like a mock neck and it does have a zipper in the back so let's try her on. It's in a size large. It was $60. And there we go. Okay. Okay. So this is as good as it's going to get by myself. Um, it definitely can zip. That's no problem. A little unforgiving here, but I really do like it. The only thing is, like, you can definitely... Yeah, it'll zip. That's no problem. I just need somebody to do it for me struggles of living by yourself but um i really really like it it's cute i cannot of course gain a pound before i wear it um and i can wear it with like some cute flat sandals this would be really cute spring i feel um the thing is you can't really wear like any shapewear and then what type of undergarments do you wear because um, you can almost see through it. So shapewear isn't really an option. I might get like one of those footless stockings and wear under it just so you can't see through it. And I'll get some black ones and wear underneath it. So yeah, I like it. Tell me what y'all think. She cute. Throw on my big bag with it. Big brown shades. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. On to the next set. One piece jean jumper, y'all. She is cute. She is cute. She is cute. Look at the back. It's out. It's out. Y'all know I'm on this whole backless kick. Like, I don't have back rolls, but... And, so what? Y'all got some rolls, but it's cute. Let's see. Let's see what she do. She's wide leg. Her was $39. Alright, now. Back to my... <laughs> She got to lose some pounds, but I think she cute, y'all. What y'all think? I mean, yeah, I could lose some weight here, but I mean, this is a spring summer, so I got, I got some time to get it right, get it tight. But this is cute. Now let's see what that back looking like. Let's see what she giving y'all. That's cute. I can still wear a bra. Yeah. A good dry cleaning to get our iron. It doesn't have any pockets. So that's a thing, but that's okay. I like it. This is perfect for the spring, early summer here in Atlanta. Vacation at the resort. Now we don't get no booty, but that's okay. I think it's cute. What y'all think? You know me and my pictures. Hand on my face, my signature. What y'all think? Um, I would still, again, I would keep it low-key and just wear some cute flat sandals. Love me a good flat sandals. Some, um, probably gold or 
tan. Yeah, I probably do tan or something. But I think she's cute. What's the signature pose the girls are doing now? No, I can't do that. I like it. She's definitely going to get somewhere. She might be in rotation a couple times. Yeah. Back out. Cute. She cute. Okay, and then my last piece that I have here is this gold. I'm sorry. <laughs> this silver like mesh um metallic skirt it was $29 it's in a size large let's see what she do so I would wear this like with a high cut brief um or what I'm really thinking is this is going to be like a swimsuit cover-up for a bikini bottom yes your girl do wear two pieces so like a bikini top of course and I'd wear this skirt with it so I mean, something along these lines. Out at the beach, resort. Cute. High-waisted bikini. Or a thong on that, on that thing. Cause she do, yep. When she go on vacation, vacation. When she get a vacation, she gonna be cute. I like it. What y'all think? It is like a midi. I do prefer that my stuff hits the floor, but this is cute. This is definitely cute for the pool, resort, beach. That was my Zara haul, y'all. That was my Zara haul. Those three items. Um, see. So those three items I picked up at Zara. I am going to check and see if I can find this cream jumpsuit. If I can find it online in a extra large, because it does go up to an extra large. My battery is about to die. But yeah, I'm going to see if I can find it in an extra large and see if I like it. And if they have it, of course, I'll get it and see the difference between the large versus the extra large. It did not have any stretch, so I don't know. Sorry, I don't know if that's a thing too, but I'll keep y'all posted if they have the extra large. And I got another package. Some gym shoes that I ordered over Christmas came in. So I was gonna open these with you guys and see what you think about them. My first time having a pair of, is it Asics? You know, the girlies are wearing these and they wear the New Balances like crazy. So, wanna see what they do. So, Let's open these babies up and see if I like them, see if they fit. Um, it was really more so like a blind buy. I don't know what size I wear in this shoe, this brand rather. So I bought a size nine. Usually in gym shoes, I can do a nine. Now boots, sandals, stuff like that, your girl's a big foot 10, okay? But um, in gym shoes, I can typically do a size nine. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see what she do, okay? So let me bring y'all in a little closer. This is the right angle. So there's that. So these are like the metallic ASICs. They do look a little big, a little long over there. I don't know, y'all. She'll she a little long. So let's try it on and see what it do. I'm not mad at her. She not bad. Let me zoom y'all in. So y'all can really see how she looking. She cute, right? Not bad. She comfortable. Okay, so let's see what it looks like with a sock or if I can fit it with a sock. With the sock, it's working. She working. 
Hey, what's going on guys? So I just wanted to pop in and say hi to the vlog. I've been crazy busy at work today and so I'm trying to finish up some work before my call. I have a call at six o'clock to wind down the night from working. So yeah, just been trying to put some plays in action. And of course now my phone wants to ring um, while I'm talking to my people, but yeah, so I'm hoping everyone is doing well. I'm trying to get organized. I'm buying some, I bought some items to like organize my workspace area at the house and I'm trying to pull that together so I can be more productive. I'm also trying to step more into my creative side, content creating side. So um, I've taken a couple different classes and yeah, you know, I've, I've, I think I've said this to you all before, but if I haven't, I'm not one of those girls that's really big into like self-help and, um, you know, reading books and those um, posts and stuff about new me, new, th I'm, I'm not her. Um, but I have been looking at things that I feel I can invest in to better myself. And so that's some of the things that I really want to work on for, um, I won't say for the new year, but just in general. I need to learn some new skill sets so that I can be productive in what it is that I want to do. Um, one of the things that I really want to get into is UGC, which is user generated content. And that's where you work with different brands and promote their products. You are basically now their marketing and advertising person. And so just like your everyday life, how you incorporate these products from different brands, whether it's a well-known brand that's such as Target or um, the Ordinary, or if it's just a small brand that's trying to get up off the ground and they just need some content from everyday people to use their products, rate it, give reviews, um, just talk about it. That's what I really want to step into. It's a really good way to generate a lot of money once you really get into it. It does take some time to step into, um, so you really have to have like a good pro, um, portfolio, pictures, videos, and then you yourself have to really put yourself out there. It, it does require some work and time. And so on my downtime, that's something that I have been working on. And I've actually been working on like my portfolio for a while. Um, I need to just go full throttle and get it done. So that just requ um, requires me to do a lot of recording, a lot of pictures and stuff. And I'm not that girly that does like um, get ready with me's you know, talking about, um, you know, what I, I'm using and stuff. That's, that's not really me. And I don't have a problem with doing it, but I also don't like put myself out there to be a fashion girl. I'm not a fashionista. I'm not good at putting outfits and stuff together. I try and, you know, sometimes they turn out cute. Other times, baby, I'm in a two-piece legging set. <laughs> Tanisha, um, you guys know my best friend. She and I talk about it all the time. Like we have gotten so comfortable and I'm, I'm blaming some of it on COVID that, you just want to be comfortable. You want to throw on something easy breezy and get out the door. So I have a million and one two-piece sets in a variety of colors and styles that I just throw on, throw on a baseball cap, and your girl is out the door. And so only time I really put on good clothes or my cute stuff, I feel, is when I'm going somewhere. And when I say going somewhere, like out on a date or out on the town with the girls or I'm traveling, something like that. But day-to-day -day running to Target run into the office i'm bad i, I don't get cute for that y'all see i don't even unwrap my hair like and i need to do better and i have to do better um because of like i said what i really want to step into and not even just for ugc again which is user generated content but i wouldn't mind being more active on social media I, um as you guys know I, I have the youtube but i feel like that's just every day but um I would like to be more active in providing valuable information on YouTube and all of my social media platforms. So that is something that I'm also working on. So I'm kind of like content batching. And that means putting together a bunch of footage, a bunch of pictures, videos um, of me doing different things, wearing clothes, actually doing makeup and stuff like that for myself. Um, so I'm stepping out the box. I'm stepping out the box, trying some new things in 2024. And it's not even because it's 2024. It's because for me, I got to do it. 
we all need different hustles and, and stuff like that. And I need to step outside of what I'm used to doing. Stop being so comfortable in the space that I'm in. I don't want to get so complacent that I get burnt out and bored. So that's why I'm trying to step into something new. So I want you guys to keep me encouraged in this new journey. Make sure you guys are staying up to date on all of my videos. And as I start to go into this posting phase, and I'm about to, not phase, this new posting journey that I'm about to go on on all of my um, social media platforms. So if you're not following me, all of my social media is OK Nelly, I see you. So um, that's YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat, as well as TikTok. Um, not much to see right now, but oh, it's coming. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Get ready, get ready, get ready. It's coming, okay? So yeah, just um, giving myself room to express myself more and put myself out there, be open and willing. Um, I was nervous, especially even nervous about starting my new uh, my YouTube channel just because I didn't know how people would receive me. Here I am, a 40-something-year-old woman, no kids, I'm, si um, I'm not married, you know? So... I didn't know if I have anything to put out there, but I just have to pick up the camera more because every day I'm, I'm doing something and I don't want my content to always just be, oh, I'm running to Target. Oh, I'm running to Home Goods. Oh, Nelly out to eat. And what's crazy is my <laughs> my sisters, uh, we were talking when I was at home and they was like, you always posting going to Target. Girl, I go to Target like y'all go to Dollar General. Like, like y'all go to the gas station, that's how I go to Target. Like it's, it's nothing for me to go to Target. For one, it's right down the street from my house. So I just run in Target all the time. I was there yesterday. I was there yesterday trying on clothes. Y'all y'all watch my vlog, you'll see. I bought some stuff, use my points in Target. So, I mean, yeah, I, I do. I go to Target all the time. I, it ain't no Walmart by me, and y'all know I don't really care for Walmart anyway. So yeah, I, I I do. And I know you guys don't want to always see me in Target. And I don't, I don't want to burn you out with just going there. So I will take you as I go out. But I'm also going to take you as I'm in, in my house, doing what I do around the house. I don't do much because I'm usually just working at home and sleeping. I don't really watch TV, although I did this weekend. I watched a movie. I was actually talking to my friend and um, they were like, what do you what, what do you watch on TV? I said, baby, I don't think my TV was even turned on in the month of December. My bedroom TV. Oh, I know that hasn't been turned on maybe since October. I don't, mm, I don't, I don't really watch TV. It's not my thing. Um, I watch YouTube. That's what I like. That's why I said as much as I enjoy YouTube. I need to get up on that thing. So I got up on that thing. So yeah, that's 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 me. I, I enjoy I enjoy watching everyday people do everyday things. And that's what I want to give to y'all. Me, everyday Nelly, doing everyday things. Just whatever it be, whatever it is. So I hope that you guys are enjoying the information that I'm putting out there. Um and then tell me what y'all want to see. I've asked before, so I'm going to say it again. Let me know what y'all want to see, things that you guys may want to talk about. Because for those of you that really do know me, know me personally, you know that I'm a talker. I can go. I can go. And baby, I can talk to the best of them. The high, the low, the rich, the po, the affluent, regular schmegalas. I can, I can go with the best of them. And I, I just enjoy people. I'm very much so a people person. I enjoy talking to people, getting to know people. And um, yeah, so... Let me know what you guys want to talk about. I was told today that I need to go live. I've never gone live before. So maybe I'll try it. Maybe I'll give it a whirl and two or three people will pop on. Um, something that I am going to start doing is called Wind Down Wednesdays with Nelly. So, you know, we'll be in the comforts of my home or a space or wherever I'm at. And I'll get on and I may do that on live. Or I just talk to y'all. I'll have a topic and we'll just go in. And if it's just me on there talking, I'll just run off. I will run off at the mouth on that topic, whatever it be. So, yeah, I hope you guys join me for those Wind Down Wednesdays. They will start next week. We might do just a soft run um, this week, but I know for sure next week I'll definitely start my Wind Down Wednesdays. So, you guys stay tuned for that to come. And, yeah, so, like I said, I have a call that starts at 6 and it is 5.53. So I am going to get prepared for that call, actually for work, like I said, with one of our program participants. So I will 
holla back at y'all later. Um, no plans for the night. Probably just chill out, relax, watch YouTube because that's what I enjoy. That's what I like. I'll um, let you guys know who like my top three YouTube girls that I love to watch. It's really two, but um, I can definitely give you my top three YouTube girls that I love to watch their um, their channels. They're just so funny. They're just like getting to it. Um, very much so successful everyday girls like me that have now just taken this YouTube platform and baby, baby, they, they, y'all, y'all, I, I need you guys <laughs> to be sharing these videos, liking these videos, commenting under my videos. I really want to take this YouTube and social media to the next level. Just a regular girl from Romulus, Michigan, doing big things, you know, and I know it's, it's obtainable for me. It's obtainable for all of us, you know, so. Whatever y'all want to do, just step into it and do it. Step outside of your comfort zone um, and just do it. That's what I'm doing. So y'all can do the same too. Let's keep each other encouraged, empowered to do what we have been called upon to do. So yeah, I'll holler back at y'all as I prepare for this call and you guys be great. Hey guys, so I just ran to Target and I found these jeans. Let me fix my hair. <laughs> I found these jeans that I think would be really, really cute. Well, they are really cute. What y'all think? They're like wide leg. They don't have any stretch now. That's the thing, no stretch. But I thought they were real cute. I like the wash that they're not super light, a little distressed, and then of course, you know, the knees. And then they're wide, so I think this would be really cute with some Gym shoes, even some sandals in the spring. What y'all think? Um, again, these are from Target. Okay, let me put y'all a little closer. So, these are from Target. Wild Fable. 30 bucks. Size 12. They have no stretch, so just keep that in mind. But I do like how they fit. Um... You know, your girl ain't working with nothing back there, so that don't matter. But I think they're super cute. Super cute. No. Yeah. Why? I've been wanting some wide leg jeans, so yeah. I'll put them in the description box so you guys can find these jeans. If you if you like them, if you think they're cute, once I put a good little iron to them. Okay, so the next piece I found at Target is this Aritzia wanna be jumpsuit what y'all think it got the little cutout on the side i think that's cute it does have like little the little um nipple covers or whatever inside i have to fix those and get them right but yeah she she holding it down um i'm liking it and i don't even have on a bra okay i think i think it's a winner 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 chicken dinner so with that, baby, I got it in black too, okay? I got it in black as well. This is going to be perfect for the summer, spring and summer. Throw a little jean jacket on because, you know, uh, or a little extra little shirt or something. But this is cute. And y'all, this, this is where those points, when you shop at Target all year and you have all those points that turn into money, baby, this is when I buy this type of stuff. I don't buy this type of stuff <laughs> any other time. So this was $40. And I think the Aritzia one, wait, and the brand though is Joy Lab. So I'll tag it in the description box if you're interested. I'm telling you, it fits really good. This is a size large. It has amazing stretch. I know some of you other girlies like to, you would say, oh, I could get that in a medium. I'm not going to play myself like that. I'm not gonna even play, cause I mean, it does. It has crazy stretch, but I like this. I'm good. Seems like the crotch might be a little long. <laughs> Let me see. That might be a little better, but yeah, I like it. With the little cutout right there. 
Let me know what y'all think. Because I, I really think she cute. And she holding it in. And like I said, they also have it in this black. So, I got both. Don't be mad when y'all see this on the recycle bin. Okay? Cute. Target for the win, y'all. Okay, and then I got another package. This one is from Nordstrom. So, I don't know if you guys are with Fetch Rewards, but I am. And I've been with them for a few years, and I've never cashed out on my points. And I have, like, just under 100,000 points with them. And so, I said, you know what? I'm going to use those points and give me something. So, I bought these shoes with the gift card that I traded my points in for to Nordstrom's. So everyone has been on TikTok and mainly Instagram with these shoes. So I was like, let me see what they do. Let me see how they look. Since I ain't have to pay, I'm not mad. But I got me some Sambas. What y'all think? I love the color that is two-tone black and like an off-white cream almost. Then they also, I see, they give you white laces, which don't match because it's cream. Clearly it's cream. Um, so yeah, what y'all think? Let's see. Let me see how they fit. Um, what size? I purchased these in a size 8. No, I didn't. I know. I know I would not do a size 8 in these. Baby, they might have to go back. Oh, Lord. Your girl cannot wear nobody's... A men's 8. No, a men's 7 and a half. Seven, seven and a half. Um, I have a few pair of Yeezys, and I think they're. I like they cute, huh? I like them. I think they're a keeper, y'all. So this is a size eight. Again, these are from Nordstrom. They were, of course, on a link um, for someone I saw on Instagram with them. And I like the color. So, yeah. She winning. Okay. Okay, Adidas, size 8. <laughs> and I wouldn't wear socks with these for real anyway. If they were, they're like the no-show. So, it wouldn't be a thick sock. And I still have wiggle room in here. So, I'm good. Hey, hey, hey. I know it's been a minute. It's been a minute. <laughs> but I have been on go. Um, so I just wanted to welcome the vlog and hope everyone is doing well. As you guys know, it has been so freaking cold. Oh my God, I can't believe it's this cold even in Atlanta. Like, it's so cold, I had to pull, I had to pull her out. <laughs> I didn't think I was even gonna get nowhere this year, but um, yeah, it's cold. They canceled school in Michigan, of course. Um, but here in Atlanta, they canceled school yesterday. And then um, they did let the kids go back today. Even though I don't have no kids. I'm just saying, it's that cold. So, yeah, I had to get me a little Dunkin'. A little Dunkin'. Because it's that cold. Your girl is cold out here in these streets. So, yeah. So, I just wanted to, again, welcome the vlog. Hope everyone is staying warm and staying safe. I'm actually headed off to a meeting. I have three meetings today. And I'm actually going to tap into one of my friend's podcasts. I don't know if it's a podcast. It's on YouTube. So, I guess it's a podcast and a YouTube channel. So, I'm going to pop in on his channel today he's gonna do some recording so gonna see what that's gonna be about you know and then yeah that's it just a little bit of busyness busyness that's not even a word i got a few things going on today how about that well, we are here on set we are doing like i said a podcast youtube recording for a client so i had to make sure everything was set up for that doing an interview with a pro football player here today and so i just made sure that you know the green room was set up all of the things that they need for the um for the video i got all the questions and everything pulled together for the interview so it should really be a cool cool event so i'll make sure you guys are able to record into the behind the scenes of this recording today.
know what I'm saying? Appreciate you making the time. Always. Oh, man, say, I pulled the pen. He ain't gonna come get the whip for anything, man. He ain't never tell me when. I'm fucked with him. I got a little Latino girl with dudes, bro. Man, you know what I'm saying? You put you on this mobile though. Yeah. Really? Mobile now. Yeah, yeah. I'm on my phone. Yeah, yeah. You need me sick. No, I'm fine. Wait, anyway. So we saw it. We saw you got the time. You in a rush? Nah, nah, we good. I'm just let my man get set. What is this about now? It's a B1 vitamin pack, 75 milligrams of thiamine. Works to give you great energy, really works. Give you great energy, all natural, no caffeine. So okay, it, 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 so it's it, like it, a B12 it, on steroids. <laughs> Other people say, but it's really just you to patch B12. You gotta inject. Yeah, so. so you just put that on, like where? Yeah, where yeah. you put it on your body at? You put it anywhere your body. You put it on your stomach. You put it on your arms. I seen it everywhere. And how long it lasts? About six hours. Oh, okay. About okay. Hours. So, but if, you, so, but if you're doing actual sports, probably right after you're done. Hey, wrap it. You going when you introduce? Talk to this camera. Okay. And then, yeah, and then after that, just more conversation. So you know, right? Look, look at him, and then. Switch to the camera when you talk. Yeah, so when y'all intros, because I'm a, um, when you talk, I'm going to turn this towards you. So. Right. Let me know when you're ready. Fly out. Go out. Do it. Jump up. Jump up. Okay, so this is the fit. Nothing fancy. Let me bring it out a little closer. It gets a little better light. So, it's just some black jeans from Fashion Nova. This is a top from Zion. I don't really like my chest out. So, this, I think the bra is pushing it even more. But, anyway. This is a top from Zara. Some gold like hoops you saw these and of course yeah so what do y'all think i don't know about that might be a little too much for your girl you know she's a little older a little more reserved i don't know i got another shirt but It's like a wrap shirt. It's a little still root. It might still have the chest out. So, we ain't got that. Let's see. Mm. Uh, we gonna go with this shirt. We just gonna go with this shirt. It's gonna be what it is. I got a scarf that I'll put in right here. So this is it. Can't do nothing about. Can't do nothing about them. So I'm gonna put on some suede boots, and I'll 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 get my best friend to take a picture.